What's up guys, Spore Knight here. Welcome to episode 4 of Undertale. I figured out why, for the first three episodes, why there was no audio. Um, I had to reinstall Camtasia onto my computer, and um, in that time, uh, when I had to reinstall, it didn't uh, remember the option of record system audio, so now it's doing that. So yeah, you'll be able to hear stuff. So, um, you can hear the music now and how I like it. Excuse me. Um, okay, so I'm in the hotel. If you can't tell. But let's continue. This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Sincerely, a box lover. Use the box? Sure. Stick. Tough glove. Okay. Okay, and item. You equip tough club. Yay. Fight. Snow Drake flutters forth. Um. <laughs> you made a bad at least pun. Do I need to just start attacking? Oh, I feel bad now. <laughs> I'm gonna go this way. So, as I was saying about Undine... Uh, I, I need to make a voice for him. <clears throat> so, as I was saying about Undine... Huh? Person. Human? What? Huh? Split, split. <laughs> Sans, oh my god, is that a human? Exclamation question, exclamation question. <laughs> I love how Sans has a little laughing tone to it. Uh. Actually, I think that's a rock. Oh. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> is... is that a human? Yes. <laughs> oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undine will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... popular! 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 Um... Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Uh, capital. Then... Then... I'm not sure what's next. <laughs> In any case... Continue... Only if you dare. Yeah. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Yeah, let's see what's the other way. Huh. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Sure. Call me, here's my number. 
You decided not to call. Yeah. I wonder, is it in my cell now? No. I'm also really sad that I killed Goat Mom. Apparently there's a way that you could have prevented that from happening. Ah, another battle. These take us on. Ice cap struts into view. Okay. Ice cap is de desperate for attention. Oh! At this point, I can spare him. Yay! There's some narration on this cardboard box. <laughs> you observed the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was that very fansome... Uh, fansome? I don't English good. <laughs> that very famous royal guardsman. No, not yet a very re famous royal guardsman. Absolutely no moving. can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. So do I not do anything? I'm gonna stay still for a second. Take another sip of Mountain Dew. No sponsorship. Easily excited by movement. Hobbies include squirrels. Who would have guessed? Don't move an inch. Oh goodness. Doggo can't seem to find anything. Okay, that's good. Will it move this time? Yes, it's not white, so it's not going to damage me. I'll just keep checking. Will it move this time? You pet doggo. <laughs> what? I've been pet? <laughs> he looks so happy. Pot, 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 pet, pot. <laughs> you won. Yay. Something pet me. Something that isn't moving. <laughs> I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Hello? Is anybody there? No? Are you two playing a trick on me? Real funny. <laughs> Big guy? Is that you? Come on. Well, it's not the tall skeleton. He's too loud. Whoever you are, knock it off. I'm sorry. <laughs> Someone's been smoking dog treats. Oh, goodness. Hi. Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine a blue stop sign instead. Cool. <laughs> Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. Oh.
North Ice, South Ice, West Ice, East Snowden Town, and Ice. So, North. How do you get from there to there? Hey! Hello, I am a snowman. I can see that. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, Traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Yes! Thank you. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. Yay! How am I doing? By I, I mean the piece I gave you. You're doing well. I'll take you with me. You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. I'd agree. <laughs> excuses, excuses. Oh, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. Yay, puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sound like fun? Excuse me. Because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. Sans, what did you do? I, th I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Hold this, please. Okay, try now. I can make myself float. Whee! Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It is designed by my brother, Sans. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> and he just flies directly backwards. Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see the weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? <laughs> I wonder if I could have just walked straight through. Mr. Ice Cream Man? I want to understand why these aren't selling. It's perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. Hello, would you like some nice cream? Yeah. It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold. Sure. Have a super duper day. You got the ice cream. Ice cream is the frozen treat that warms your heart. No, thank you. Well then, tell your friends. There's ice cream out in the middle of the woods. Not sketchy at all. It's a rock. Okay. I've been thinking about selling treats, too. Want some fried snow? Sure. Sure. Really? How about 5,000 gold? What? You don't have the money. Hey, that's okay. I don't have any snow. <laughs> okay. Huh. Okay. So I'm playing golf with this. Boop. Boop. Oh, so it's time limit based. Yay! Golf. 
off the Undertale way. It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow, <laughs> snow decahedron. Ha! Hmm, if that is there, then what's up here? Okay. His. Hers. Smell danger rating. Snow smell. Snowman white rating can become a yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell. Puppy blue rating start smell of rolling around. Weird smell. Humans green rating destroy at all costs. Hmm. Okay. Not sure what that's all about, but okay. I like the snow decahedron. Human, I hope you're ready for... Sands, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. Monster Kids Word Search. Hey kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Okay. Fall. I could find them all, but I don't think I'm going to. Sands, that didn't do anything. Whoops. I knew it should have been it should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really, dude? That's easy peasy word scramble. That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. Which is harder? Hmm. This makes an effect on the game. I want Papyrus to feel good. Ha! Huh. Ha! Huh, yes! Humans must be very intelligent. If they also find ju Junior Jumble so difficult. Yeah, 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 yeah. Thanks for saying Junior Jumble just to appease my brother. Yesterday he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Is this something to look at? No. Okay. It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. Little do you know, the spaghetti is a trap, designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it, that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly... Japed? Jamped? Against by the great Papyrus. Nyaha. <laughs> papyrus. It's an unplugged microwave. All of the settings say spaghetti. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. Nice. What's this up here? Oh, it's the mouse! Knowing the mouse might one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti, it fills you with determination. Okay, so I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Make sure to leave a comment down below. Bye-bye.